What's up guys, it's Blonde Jimmy here, and today we're playing The Sims 4 once again. I've never been more excited in my life to get back into The Sims, because I've set up a little something special for all y'all. Last week I said I was going to buy a DLC of some of the DLCs, the expansion packs, and I did, and I bought uh, The Sims 4 Cats and Dogs expansion pack. That's what we're going to be playing today. We're going to be making uh, my cat, well, my sister's cat, Chunky Monkey, better known as Atlas. Well, we call him Chunky Monkey because he's just a little Chunky Monkey. Roll the clip. Chunky! Chunky Monkey! No! No! <laughs> what a f***ing cat. He's disabled. When he was like a year old or like a half a year old, a dog fell on him. Now he can't move his leg properly anymore. He's, he's a little bit disabled. And we make fun of him for that. He's fat as well. He's like a fat cat. But we love him regardless. So yeah, let's get right in. Now, as well, to keep it going with uh, the political theme, I've made a sim to look after our, our friend Chunky Monkey. And that sim is uh, our, our brand new Prime Minister, Scott Morrison, ScoMo. Uh, he's a pet lover, and I made him into a vampire because I don't want him to die of old age and leave my chunky monkey alone. <laughs> all right, here's our friend, Scott Morrison. I think I did a pretty good job. What does Chunky Monkey look like? Chunky Monkey, what breed of cat is he? I don't know. He's just a fat cat. Jesus Christ, there are f too many cats. Oh, that looks like my other cat. Aw. This is great. This is the best thing I've ever purchased in my entire life. Is that a raccoon? What the heck? That's awesome. That kind of looks like Chunky if he was a bit skinnier. So maybe we can just make him- oh, oh. That doesn't really do a lot. There you go, fat. But how do I make him fat? He's just white. He's just a white cat with a fat head. There we go. <laughs> oh no. That's really bad. There we go. Just a white cat. What does your face look like, Chucky? He's a big old happy mouth. Kind of, he, oh my god, his eyes are so messed up. That's perfect, you got a round head. Something about this cat, I don't know what I did, but it really freaks me out. I don't know. It's the thing's the neck. Can we make him fatter? He needs to be fatter than this, please. Sarah, I'm filming The Sims! What the heck is that? Where'd you get the pizza? Shut this door and leave my house. Sarah! The nerve of some people. We're just gonna keep going. <laughs> there we go. That's my Chunky Monkey. What's Chunky? Now, Chunky is literally the best cat that's ever lived. Because Chunky is... He's lived a life of pain, and that's it. He had a bunch of, like, other cats, and they all went missing. All of them. He's, 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 oh, he loses his friends. He's, he's disabled. He's got a messed up arm. He's very friendly. And he does eat a lot. He's fat, fat, chunky monkey. He really doesn't do much else of anything. He's, he's, he's just sad. <laughs> Why isn't there one for sad? Someone left a freaking fridge open. Hello, my name is Chunky Monkey. Now, I'm very disappointed with what I've been able to come up with here, but I think it's good enough. We have Scott Morrison uh, digging up the dirt that is our government right now, and he found some limestone. <laughs> Can you control the cat? No, you can't. You can't do anything with the cat. <laughs> This is, without a doubt, one of the more interesting things that I've done in my life. What's the point of having a cat if you can't control what it does? 
God, what have I done? I've just created Scott Morrison into some kind of an internet personality. He's already Prime Minister. What more do you want, Scott? Jeez. Jesus Christ! Look at him go! Well, I guess the only thing to do now is make a thousand cats. A thousand just random cats. And I'm gonna put them all in Scott Morrison's house. Let's get a raccoon in there while we're at it. In fact, let's just fill the house with just raccoons now. Axel Red Key. Booger or Lana. We love Boogle. Booger. Okay, here we are in Scott Morrison's house. I can see a bunch of raccoons. <laughs> Jesus Christ, is that it? Is that it, Scudmo? Is that your painting? Are you done? My game crashed. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> I'm gonna have to postpone that for a minute. Welcome back to The Sims. A um, little bit of a mishap. Don't know what happened, but game crashed. Uh, too many raccoons, methinks. Oh, all of the raccoons are gone. Jesus Christ. I'm loving the new hair. Look like that one episode of Twin Peaks, where the dad's hair just changes and shit. Alrighty, here we are back with Scott Morrison. What the heck? Scott, you can't always play on the computer! <laughs> oh my god! If I saw this in real life, I'd be crying. This is terrifying. Who the heck is that? Now, one thing about Scott Morrison that I wanted to share was um, Scott Morrison's vampiric form. Now, since Scott Morrison likes cats so much, <laughs> <laughs> I thought it'd only be fitting to make his vampire form a cat person. Oh my god, he's so fast! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Prime Minister of the United States... Wait. Ladies and gentlemen, Prime Minister of Australia, uh, Scott Morrison. Why can't I pick up these goddamn cats? There we go. Let's get a, get a view of that. <laughs> I think that's a good place to end it off today. Uh, don't worry. We will return to Scott Morrison and the six raccoons in the future. Uh, because I just can't get enough of what kind of travesty I've created here. Uh, yeah. Remember to like and subscribe to my new YouTube channel. Uh...